Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 30 of Path of Exile, a synthesis on the Xbox One X. Where exactly we're at the end of part 29. And I'm hoping... Hey? Oh, hello. Uh, have... Yes, Stephen, control blocks. No waypoint yet. Oh good, it's undiscovered. Uh. So much for dying, eh? Of course, the levels are never the same, so I've no idea if I've got to go to the right, same location or not. Taxic cell fight. Nico armed and dangerous is back. Was it me there?
Yeah, well, this is where we got the experimental blah. So I don't think there's anywhere out of here. There's a door up there, though, isn't that? Oh, no, there's not. Oh, there, this bit. Secuta Helm. combination of moves I've got is just awesome. Absolutely awesome. I love it. Excellent. Scholar boots. Just the very boots I wasn't looking for.
Goodness gracious me, people. I feel like I'm going backward rather than forward. This way. Eyes of Zeal. Enter the Templar courts, did it say? Yeah. A one-handed mace with three sockets. Doesn't look any great shakes, but we may be able to make it into something. I prefer one with four, though. Being very stingy with these chests, I have to say. Oriath Square. Find the Voltaxic sulfite deposits. One of three. In what? In that area? Let's have a look. <clears throat> well, we know where the door is at least now. Don't know why I bother with nothing in it again. It can't be Voltaxic Sulfite in this area, because there's, there's nothing undiscovered, is there? Maybe the smallest amount down the way. I, I think it must just be in general in this level, maybe. 
can always come back. Well, I say that. <laughs> There's no waypoint that I found either. Ooh, it's very snowy again. Waypoint! Yay! Well, if it happens, it's probably a good time to go back and get rid of our stocks. Oh yeah, we need to hand in the old eye of whatever. Our renovation doesn't go up that much, only by eight. And the sockets aren't good enough. Nah. Sell it all. Tala. Hang about. Moana save you. Just <laughs> like a pair of balls. Thank you. By killing Casticus, you've given us a fighting chance. And about his eyes, I'm sorry you had to do that. Yet although Otula's solution might seem brutal, I've seen Kadui men blinded with a hot poker, simply for looking a fraction too long at an Oriathan lady. Yes, this is war. And just a little revenge, too. Take something. A token of our thanks. Oh, it's one of these, is it? Quicksilver flask, stip night flask. Hundred percent evasion. What the hell? That's last four seconds consumes twenty or fifty charges on use. Currently has zero charges. Forty percent movement speed. 40% increased movement speed, 45% increased block and stun recovery of flask. So the one I've got is actually better. Uh, well, it's unidentified to be fair. Yep, completely pointless. Uh, well, hang on a minute. Why have I not given her those yet? Oh, he gets those. Not her. Freedom comes to those who fight. Uh, I'll use the Eye of Zeal to access the Templar Courts, that's why. The, uh, the Balls of Steel to access the Templar Ports, I've got it. I'm assuming that their stocks don't Something. change. Yeah. 
literally nothing of any use whatsoever. In the snow again. Here I go up in the snow again. Holy shit. It's kicking off a bit now. for me money there, old star what's his face. Why am I killing all these people that are saying I don't want to die? Alright, these guys are on my side. Well, it's not going to take long to level up in this bloody area, I'll tell you that much. Minor gut! Feels a bit bloodborne this area. Tell you what, if I was playing as my mage you one at the minute, I'd be getting absolutely slaughtered. <laughs>
I'll buy you an iron ring, my friend, and everything's gonna be alright. I've seen quite a lot of screen tearing here and there now. Just the amount of action on screen. It's alright when it's like this, but the minute, minute you get loads of enemies on screen, kicks in. All that motion. Let's get ourselves down to these totem things. There's a few things around here we can take. Armor and life regeneration. Yeah, 20% armor. Ooh, bit of a shout to do that. But we'll do that and then we'll get the gem in next, I think. And then we'll come down to the totem stuff. That lock in? Aye. down here right then as well. Well worth doing it in this area, getting loads of bloody XP. My god, that was a bit extreme. Picked up a scepter there, what's that like? 
44 to 66 with three sockets. Hmm. It's better damage wise. Could do with clearing it and making it a special, really, can I? Still got three sockets, two red and two blue. Forty two percent increased error of effect, blah blah blah. Yeah. Added fire damage. Storm brand, yeah. Let's have a think about that one. Of burden. Right. I am no beast of burden, Tala. Well, uh, what's the thing that clears the... Removes all modifiers from an item. No, that's not it, is it? What's, what's the one that clears all the... Reforges a rare item with a new modifier. Oh, maybe it is that one. Hmm. Yeah, it is, yeah. So, we could do a that's cold damage plus one to level of socketed cold gems lightning damage Whoa, 77 to 116. Shit, a brick, man. That's way higher. 103% increased physical damage. Holy hellfire. Well, we're definitely going to be using that. Um, problem is, I'd need... What was it? Stormbrand that's on it. So I'd need something... 
Whoa. The feck? I can have two single handed. Hmm. That's escaped me. Added fire damage. So basically just need a support gem that will support Stormbrand. I <laughs> bet nothing does it. I don't know. Burning damage support. Just burning damage support. Oh not bad support. Let's have a bit of that. Hang on to the old one for now, just in cases. Get rid of these. Oh shit, no, I didn't want to do that, did I? I wanted to use it. You muppet. Hurry up, Steven, before you lose your portal. there. Not bad. Let's see if we see a difference. Eee. Everything seems to be in the right place still. Yeah, I'd either forgotten or wasn't aware that I could have two single-handed weapons like that and the thing is, I wouldn't want to lose the protection of the shield. I think that's why I've not gone that route. And I've also picked up shield perks as well. I don't know why I'm killing these people, but anyway.
some area this for the old fights, isn't it? Aha, stately hideout. Let's go in, shall we? Oh, Helena, hello. The Blackguards will never stop pursuing someone they consider a traitor. I'm a danger to everyone around me and not long for this world if I can't oh, don't find a place to hide. This seems like a good area to build a hideout, but it's filled with monsters. Oh, I... Can you clear it of everything dangerous? Sure. Well, she seems to have pitched up again. That must have been a bug, because she wasn't in the other ones. Feeling like this mace is way more rubber. Seems to be taking them down a lot quicker. That music is awesome. Just saying. Hideout unlocked. Job done. Curious. With the death of the last monster here, the very air itself feels different. I wouldn't use the word purified, but you've definitely negated the pile over this place. I'll stay here for now and make sure nothing dangerous re-emerges. That's very kind of you, thank you very much. That being said, I don't recall the benches and stuff pitching up again where you can make things and all that malarkey unless that's been taken out but then what's the point of the bloody hideout then I don't get it like I do feel quite bad about killing them. I'm not even sure I'm getting bloody points for them. Where the bloody hell am I meant to be? Oh, hang on, there's something up here. Yes, I think we were here before, in fact, and I went back, didn't I?
I feel that that was two bridges taking me the same way, yeah. Seems reasonable. Oh, do bugger off, Kavas. Exclamation mark up at the top. Temple of Court's entrance. <laughs> We've done everything we can here, pretty much. Find High, Temp High Templar, somebody or other. A various. Killing my own kind here. Yeah. It's not good, is it? Well, there'd be a waypoint. And a couple of chests. Ooh. What? Oh, those boots might be quite uh, funky if I level if I get those. Thing it up a bit. There's a couple of bits there, weren't there, that look quite sexy. Uh, well, they were greens, which is why I picked those up. The gloves are um, yeah, sat satin nightmares. But those boots, though, maybe, maybe. Talamoana, savior. Yeah, if you get pick up the items with all the three colours in them, you seem to get those gems that change the colour of the sockets. Faux show. Sure. Yes. Oh. Stop it. <clears throat> Four sockets. Yeah. It's this it's this bloody speed, isn't it? Armor. Level forty five and below. Uh, that might work. Minions have increased maximum life. Uh. Chance to avoid being shocked. Dexterity. Oh, well. Dexterity is not the end of the world, I don't suppose. Hmm. 
maximum life. Plus one to level so to socketed cold gems, which I'm not using. Could just use a normal one right enough. Seem to have a few of them. Twelve, I think. All me might be for now anyway. Ooh. 53% increased armor and evasion. It's the movement speed we lose, which is really annoying for running around. said we can put all of those on can't we <laughs> and still have room for an extra support thing because at the moment we've, we haven't we've only got an evasion of 93 which is fine and that isn't much different but we, that would give us 84 armor as well as plus 53 percent armor and evasion on top of that so it would be higher in the end uh, well no it's not because i've got 102 increased ra rating on the ones i'm wearing it's because the legendary ones the perks are so bloody good In fact, we're not even using that move on there. That summons a totem that casts a beam of fire. We're not using that. We'd actually be better moving a move onto it and giving it better support if there's two moves on another item. Might have a look at that off camera. Because there's shockwave totem and Holy Flame Totem, we've both got multiple totems on it, I suppose. But if we find another one that's got... So Ground Slam and Earthquake are both on there. So technically speaking, that could have three supports, and the other one could have three supports as well if we put this one on. But it's all for the sake of movement speed. Mind you, having said that, the evasion rating of 102% is bloody awesome as well, isn't it? Fifteen percent movement speed and ten percent, so it's twenty-five percent movement speed. And that's not got any. Oh well, it was worth a try. We'll hang on to them though. You never know. Might use them. Well, we can get rid of those now. Yes. No now. God damn it. Right, well, that is an ideal place to wrap things up, methinks, people, for this particular part, before we crack into the next point, well, which I'm now forgetting. Yes, the Templars, Templar Courts, I think it was, wasn't it? And we shall carry on with that in the next part. It has been an honour and a privilege to serve for you once again in Path of Exile on the Xbox One X, and I'll catch you next time, folks. Take it easy. Bye.